Yeah. Yeah. All right, so we're doing a piece that's approximately 14 inches by nine and a half. We're folding it over and fold it away from me, keeping the fold next to me. And then we're gonna fold it over on itself. And then over on itself again. And then, you know, this is just marking the height. Right, right. But as far as look, and make a mark. Well, wait a minute. I okay, there we go. Ice cream in a paper bowl. You know, but I've got lots of them. And, uh, no, four. And then she's measuring down about an inch and a half. An inch and a half. And, and making a little dot there. And, and then, then connecting those dots and the other dots. Yeah, kind of never been touched. And you do that on both sides, right? Well, we got and, got and, got and, and you do that on both sides, yes? No, just, no, the, just side. the one side? Just the side. Oh, okay. Because then when we cut it, it's going to cut. Okay. It's still double. Oh, okay. Yeah. Yeah. So now when you open, open it, up, it back up, leave it like this. Okay, leave it like that with the folded seam next to me. And then you're going to pin here. Wait, hold on. What are we doing? And pin here. All right, so doing that. And we're going to go sew this. Okay. Come to my machine. <laughs> All right, so now we're sewing up those little short ends. Do that on both sides. Quarter inch. What's that? Quarter inch seam. Oh, okay. Make sure you don't back stitch. Right. Back to the ironing board. Back to the ironing board. That's all that big yellow one. Yeah. We're going to open it up. I guess a little bit. We're going to match up these seams. Okay. But they're full of yellow. Fold the Sandwich. Sandwich? What do you mean? We want this one to go this way. And oh, okay. I got you. Okay, got it. Got it. And then you're going to stick a pin right down the middle. And if you don't do that, it'll be thick and you'll have a little knot that where it oh, okay. together. Okay? So now we've got that. Okay. Okay? Now we need our elastic. Okay. And what did we decide on the elastic? The one with was too loose, and the one without was a little too tight. Okay, so this one is going to be about the same size. So, So what is that? Seven and a quarter. And is this the one without or with? That's the without. Without the pocket. 
so this is seven and a quarter or you're making that a little tighter? Because this was too, this one was too loose. Or no, this one was too tight. That's enough. Right? That's it should be, yeah, I guess. Yeah. Hand me that scissors. The Christmas ones? Yes. I'm having a mat and I'm measuring on it. Look how big it is. Oh, no, okay, that's eight and a quarter. But some of that's going inside, so that's. Not that much. in here. You want to come down? About a half inch from there. Okay. Mm -hmm. I'm going to bring this back down. Stick a pin in it. And then you're going to come down about an inch and a half on this side, okay? Because this is the part that's gonna. Okay. Well, it's not a seat. It's like a casing. Yeah. Because I always just because you can tell like that. Okay. Kind of like this. Like if yeah, the figure is on the floor or something. Because it's really juicy. Do the same thing to the other side. So that's an inch and a half from the top, or about a, about a half an inch from that end, and then an inch and a half from the other end. You want to make sure this is laying so it's not twisted. Right. There's a lid shortage right now. Oh, yeah, because of the pandemic, so many people I can't find lids anywhere. So, now you're not going to start yeah. up here. You've got to leave room to turn, turn it inside out. out. So, right. you're going to start right at where the elastic is. Okay. Fairly close to the elastic. Don't sew over pants. Yeah, I've seen over pants. You should. Now we're going all the way around. We're going to come down here, put our needle in, cut it. Make sure you're sandwiched. Right? Now this one we're going all the way up, all the way here. All the way to the top and then we're going to back step. Turn it inside out. And we're gonna turn it inside out. Well, first, before we turn it inside out, we're gonna come back down here and cut these corners. All right, so you don't have bunches. Right. Now, do you need do you need to score the seam or? You can, but I don't. Oh, okay. Are you get close enough? It, it's just wound up, so just see it puckered. Oh, okay. Got caught. 
in the same. Regular. Or oh, wide. Wide mat. That's what you want to do. Twelve ninety nine for twenty four. Oh, that's a good buy. For what? For lids. Lids. You want some? How much? Twelve nine for twenty four lids. It's not that great a buy. It's not. No, I. Well, it I is. You some. can't find them anywhere else. I have yeah. some. Oh. But you still get is that them. wide mouth or regular? Wide. wide. Okay, I was going to say. Yeah, I, that's what I was saying. Yeah. Well, I have some of both, and I don't like the regular right. ones. No, I can't imagine why. Oh, here. Here's twenty four. All right, so now we're turning it inside out, and I'm going to use a chopstick to pop in the corner, out the corners, right? Is it say a brand name? No. Okay. It's not Kerr or Ball. Mason. Yeah. Things because it's not not canned or anything. Right. It's, it's not storage right. for dry. It's just a seal. Yeah. And then, you know, to keep it fresh. And you don't want to waste the lid on something that you're not actually sealed. Right. 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 Just get those plastic lids. Yeah. yeah. That's what she said. Right. Yeah. Eight, nine, nine, nine. No, maybe. Eighteen for nine. Oh, let's make sure that's there. Wide mouth. Okay. Before continuing. We've got the straps on and we've right. sewn. Okay, we're gonna, this, the opening we're gonna push in, you know, so. Right. We're gonna iron good. Right. <laughs> Not burned out the house. And you're gonna open it back up and you're gonna turn this down right at where your right. elastic is, okay? Okay, and then we're pinning that shut, right? We're gonna pin this. We're gonna pin this. And then we're gonna go back to the sewing machine and we're gonna sew all the way around here. Okay, so we're old, we're double sewing on part of it. But we don't sew across the top. No. Back to the ironing board. Back to the ironing board. Fold it. Iron it. Then you're going to open this. Pull it up. Oh, so you're basically just bringing up a triangle. Mm hmm. And then we're going to sew on that. No, it's done. Oh, you don't sew. You don't sew this no. here to hold it. No. 
Right, but after I wash it, isn't that going to disappear? Well, you're going to iron it. Oh, okay, because I, I assumed you would sew just a little dart here. None of these you've tried on have had that. Oh, okay. But if it if I want to keep that like that, if I if we did a little stitch here, would would that would that keep it from? I don't know what that would do. I mean, I mean, we can try it. Would you like me to try it? Well, no, I don't guess. I mean, if I mean, you, it's going to leave a, a a pucker. A pucker there. Right. It's not going to. I mean, you just have to iron it. Right. Well, that would imply that I get out the ironing board more than once a year, but okay. There you go. Sounds good. All right. Well, there we go. Thank you.